Yo, what's up, what's up, what's up, and welcome back to another reaction, y'all. So, uh, Jimmy Butler got a new hairstyle. Let's go ahead and check this out. It says, Jimmy Butler breaks out a new look for the NBA media day. So let's go ahead and check this out and see how you looking. Oh, he got his shit permed. Okay. I, oh, oh, shit. The nails too, Jimmy? Okay, little, little emo vibe. Jimmy, last year you came out with the braids, man. What's, what's this? I had dreads last year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. dreads. What's this? Yeah. This is, uh, my emotional state. One with my emotions. Emotional state. What 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 happened? What yeah. He upset about uh, Damian Lillard not going to the Heat. After going through it, you guys went through in the finals, the, the whole postseason run. Years, you even got the Pearsons. Um, it's a new year, new season. We came up short. Uh, I didn't do my job. We didn't do our job as a whole last year. It's a uh, it's a new season. I'm excited for it. I hope you had a good summer. Um, also, just I think there's a growing discontent among fans, especially after falling short on a couple of potential additions to the roster. And somehow, I think the overwhelming feeling is that they're wasting your prime. Do you feel like the team? You gonna be doing this a lot? Build a team that's a championship contender around you. Yeah, we stray. Um, like I always say, I know what I'm capable of. Uh, I know what my guys are capable of. So we'll continue to play basketball. He, he got to be trolling. He trolling. And somehow, someway, end up in the finals. This time we don't win. And then y'all going to say they got lucky. So I'm prepared for it. I suppose just in here saying that basically that he believes that the team uh, has what it takes to get back to the finals. Sort of related to the question you just were asked. But like, what is it about this team knowing that you know, even before you get into training camp, that could be different, maybe even, than last year's team? I mean, we got a, a couple new guys, faces that everybody's seen around the league. You got to be trolling, y'all. The guys that work incredibly hard are going to buy into doing whatever it takes for the unit, for the team to win. And uh, I don't know if we got a bunch of players. And that ain't no wig either. That's his real hair. I can see the scout. Sorry if y'all hear me scratching right now. Mosquitoes caught me lacking yesterday. You just end up winning games. The togetherness is there. Everybody knows where they stand. And, uh, that's the that's what we've taken into this year. You know, I don't think we have a chip on our shoulder. I don't think that's it. I just think we know who we are. We're confident with who we are as a team, as individuals. And that's the thing that we're gonna use to help us win. Jimmy, for you at this point, is it just about the championship? Yeah, it's always been about the championship for me. I mean, it will always be about that. Nothing else. Um, and this is our year. This is the one. And that's what's going to feel good. He got to be trolling. He got the pistons right here, the nose, the eye. Jimmy, concerned to leave the team to. <laughs> You gotta be trolling. I think we were good offensively, but I also think we were, we were solid on the defensive side as well. Um, but like I said, last year was last year. This is a brand new season. You know, we got healthy players, we got new guys. So as much as we want to keep it the same, it's going, it's going to look a little bit different. Can you speak to those new guys? Uh, Jaime's committing, obviously, talked a lot about his game being inspired by yours and kind of picking up all the different. 
things. I guess it's just been your initial impressions of him. Um, I mean, I was around him for a commercial shoot, so we were talking a lot about BS off the basketball court. Um, I'm excited to see, you know, I don't what he does on the floor because I hear that he does so many things well. I've watched a little bit of him while in college. Um, but I just want to see him get out there and have fun and compete because we are going to tour especially. <laughs> That's his real hair. Stay ready, knowing just like myself back in the day, put your phone on mute and watching me. Um, that uh, his time is gonna come, so he he just he just gotta be ready to go. Thank you, Jimmy. I want to ask you about your travels. You were <laughs> said the same thing last year. Um, I want to ask you about your travels. You uh, were in China for the release of your shoe. And you felt a lot of love there. Can you talk about your interaction with the fans over there, how they showed you love? And I also want to ask you about your relationship with Dermot Kennedy. I recently visited Ireland where they love you a lot because of your relationship with him. You met up with him over the summer as well. Can you talk about that? Uh, China was great. Uh, I got the same, like a lot of karaoke which means the world to me because um, I don't get to- And he even played, painted his nails black, y'all. But the shoe release was great. Being able to like see all the fans, and all the gifts that they give me <coughs> and my daughter, which is incredible, because I think the world knows how much I love my child. Um, but it was it was it was kind of like surreal, because coming from a small town, I mean, hell, not only am I an NBA player, but to go over there and everybody know who I am and support me and buy my sneaker and have my jersey from um, the Chicago days, skip a team, the Philly days, and then now here. It's a, it's a lot of love. And then as far as Dermot goes, that's um, that's my brother through and through. I love to go and support all my friends and all you know aspects of life. So I got to see him do like three songs while in London. Um, and I'm glad that Ireland has so much love on us. So I'm gonna go over there and uh, drink some some whiskey. Oh shit! My bad. Y'all okay? Y'all good? You all right? I'm sorry. I truly forgot the answer to this. I think I think you got asked last year, just given how next summer is. I knew it was going to happen. Did you ever do that again? Who knows? <laughs> Yo. Hey. Hey. Um. That was his real hair, y'all. Now nah, he he gotta be trolling. Listen, I want to see him play like that. I don't even watch basketball, but now, whenever the Heat is playing, I I'm gonna tune in. Cause how he gonna see if the hair is blocking his eye? His eye? How he gonna shoot? And when he running up and down the court, he gonna be doing this a lot, like you know, push, like moving the hair out his way when he running up the court. And he <laughs> like that's gonna be a distraction. He gonna have to like. Tie that back and put a headband on or something. Why he did that? Hey, listen. At the end of the day, he a grown ass man, so he could do whatever he want. He done painted his nails black and everything. Like he he must be upset because Jimmy Butler didn't go. Uh, <laughs> not Jimmy Butler. Uh, um, Damian Lillard didn't go to the Heat because wasn't he supposed to go to the Heat? But he went to the Bucks instead. Something like that. Maybe I need to uh, do my research. But um, yeah. Well, hey, that's his new look. All right, well, shit. More power to you, Jimmy. Uh, I can't wait to see you play now. <laughs> I got to see how you play with that. Because, hey, he got to be trolling. He got to be trolling. But that like his real hair, though, because I, his, his scalp right here, like, it looked real. If that's a wig, hey, because you know, I, 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 he, he usually have like a, like one of them hairstyles, like them, uh, the eraser head type of hairstyles, right? Something like that. And he said he had dreads last year. I don't even remember him seeing him with dreads last year. But anyway, that's his new look. <laughs> I guess. I mean, hey. He must have lost a bet or something. He must have lost a bet. And it was like, hey, man, if you lose that bet, you got to... Emo. I guess Halloween coming up. That must be a Halloween costume or something. I don't know. 
But anyway, hey, I got to see him play like that. I I, I got to see him play with that hairstyle. That's going to be hilarious. Anyway, uh, put your comments down below and tell me how you feel about his hairstyle. Do you think it look good on him? Does it fit him? Uh, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. <laughs> share for tuning in. See you in the next video. Peace. <laughs>